just under development at the time, and uh, a lot of things had to be done in the way of sewer lines, water lines, electrical, and so forth. The city helped in that respect. The city also helped out uh, with some of the financing. As far as I can tell, the city is very, very aggressive towards uh, new business in this area, and, and our wants are uh, high on their list. Ufala also has the kind of workforce necessary to support new business and industry. Applicants with a variety of skills and experience are garnered from surrounding counties and towns. We employ skilled laborers, and we found an abundance of that type, that type of person in this area. Uh, we have machinists, uh, welders, uh, assemblymen, uh, mechanics, painters, things of that nature, and uh, we have a good assortment of uh, applications. As, as far as, as the business is concerned, uh, the, the progressive attitudes and the uh, work ethics of the people of Eufaula is, is just tremendous. Ripple Industries employs 175 people and has been successfully doing business in Eufaula since 1980. The high quality children's clothing they produce is marketed under the Bryan label and sold nationwide in department stores. In 1986, uh, we worked out an expansion with the city of Eufaula, and we expanded the facilities from 7,000 square feet to 20,000 square feet. Uh, the expansion was financed through the city's industrial trust authority and a lease purchase agreement with the owners. The city government of Eufaula has just been tremendous, uh, progressive, uh, been over backwards to to help us expand to help us any way they could real rock incorporated is another company that chose the right business destination when coming to eufaula you know not everybody can move where they want a vacation you know you're living right the town sticks right out in a lake that's got 640 miles of shoreline it's got uh, the most aggressive bunch of people led by joe johnson the mayor down here that i've ever seen.